Terminator Dark Fate is a fast-paced thrill ride that takes the bold and exciting new step of telling an action story with female heroes. Who would have thought of that? This new and fresh take on Terminator is exactly what it needs. What did you think about it? It's the review no one was asking for because everyone already had an opinion about this crapster piece. It's time for a spoiler warning. If you watch Terminator Dark Fate, it will spoil the Terminator for you forever. One of the things I liked right away when I saw this is I said Furlong is back. Some of you who saw the other photos of Furlong, he hasn't been keeping in the best physical condition, Eddie. Eddie has had some problems with hamburgers. I was, I was happy to see Eddie Furlong here. A lot of people remember he was a teen heartthrob. So the, the women were all about this guy. Now, turns out it wasn't such a good choice, and Eddie Furlong put on a little bit of weight. However, I feel had the executives come to Mr. Furlong ahead of time, they could have put him on one of them Hollywood diets and gotten him ready to go. That would have really excited a lot of longtime fans. They'd have been happy to have him back. To protect my son. To protect my son. That's right. As we recall, Linda Hamilton was pretty hot, and also her job was to protect. To save us all. So how, how's she doing in terms of protectorating? So here we have Miss Protector. She's got her 14-year-old son buying a beer at a bar. That's protection? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't complain. I, I, should be, I should be happy. Hollywood's giving me more. So we got Eddie, underage, buying a beer. Strike one, Mom. <laughs> Next up, we got a Terminator about as big as an NFL linebacker. Bigger walking right by. And what is the response of Mrs. Protector? Oh, it's a beautiful day on the beach. What's she doing? Oh, look, now she's drawing a gun. She's still looking like, mm-hmm, yep. There's one of them giant T-800 units. What we've been fighting all this time and he's got a gun coming at my son. What am I gonna do? Oh. So he walks all the way across that bar, and then Linda Hamilton comes in, shoots him in the back. No, we can already see Eddie Furlong's legs are up in the air. He's dead. That's a panada. Here we can see Linda Hamilton has got some biceps, but she's probably still not stronger than a Terminator machine. So just once again, we're going to look at this maybe without some volume so that I do not get a copyright strike immediately. All right, let's look at this. Here she is. What a beautiful day on the beach. Terminator. Beep, 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 Terminator. And uh, four seconds too late. He is done. I'll hit him in the back a few times. Congratulations, Mrs. After the Fact. One job. Your job was to protect John Connor, and you failed at it, machine. Once again, I, I'm sorry for the cash. So she is knocked over, and we can see Terminator kills John. In her defense, they did stop all of the machines and end the thing, so this Terminator being here actually doesn't make any sense at all. It makes less sense than this casino bonus on the bootleg version I have. So where is this T-800 from? Where was he the entire time? Why did they send the liquid metal one? You see, this entire scene sort of undoes the whole first two movies. That's what the people are complaining about. So again, we have a defeated Sarah Connor crying because she failed at the one thing she's supposed to do. Got some tips for you, Miss Hamilton. Number one is even in Mexico, the law says 18 for beers. Eddie was underage. Don't let your kids drink beer. If you're being chased by giant killing robots, picturesque beach bars with your back to the ocean, not the best place. That is the scene everyone's talking about. 
For me, after this scene, it would have been difficult for anything to be good. The tried a bit, and and the story, it didn't seem to go anywhere. It was it was the same story. They tried to give a new John Connor. They picked a midget who worked in a factory. She was pretty cool, but they had this other amplified human what was looking a bit like a man, but it was a woman. So that was that was new and unique, I suppose. That's that's what the kids like. I, I see kids walking around and they got boys with makeup on and perhaps they're appealing to that demographic. And being old, I don't know what the kids like. I only know for an original fan of Terminator 2, let down. Turn around Every now and then I get a little bit nervous That the best of all the years have gone by Turn around Every now and then I get a little bit terrified And then I see the look in your eyes Turn around Right Every now and then I fall apart 